to the film in a lobby. lobby. You're going to be trespassing if you continue to film in the lobby. So, so you would arrest me for if I continue to film? You'll be trespassing. Just for future reference, a little bit of de-escalation and a little bit of respect will get you a long way, okay? That's all. Uh, there's a policy that says, just real quick, there's a policy that says there can only be two people in an elevator at a time. So uh, you guys can catch the next one. It's like a silly policy. Yeah, it is silly. Okay, thanks for admitting it. Appreciate it. Have a great day. Hey, what's up guys? Long Island Audit here, back again with another video. Today we are at the Long Beach City Hall here in Long Beach, Long Island, New York. We are here today to peacefully exercise our First Amendment right to film in public and publicly accessible areas and to ensure that our public officials and public servants treat us with respect, respect our rights, and are open to transparency and accountability. Let's see how they do. Hey, how are you? Yeah, hold on one sec. How are you doing today? Yeah, nothing. I'm just going to go through City Hall. All right, thank you. Hi, how are you, ma'am? Very well, how are you? Pretty good. Uh, what, what is this floor uh, used for here in City Hall? Are you filming me right now? I am filming you right now, yeah. Could you not do that, please? Uh, I, can, I can't stop filming, no. Okay, why are you filming? Ma'am, I, I just want to know what this, what this floor is why are you used filming? for. Ma'am, again, I just, I just want to know what this floor I is used for. Why don't you tell me where this is going to go and why are you filming me? So where is this going to go and why am I filming? I'm filming because it's my First Amendment right to film, ma'am. That's all. Are you a are you a law enforcement officer? I'm a New York State Court officer. You're a New York State Court yes. officer. Okay. So and you I, should you should know that I have the right to film law enforcement all, and government officials in the course I'd of their like duty. To know where my image is going to end up. Well, you're you're a public employee, ma'am. You're you're a public right. you're a public servant, so you know you don't have any expectation of privacy in public. So I just wanted to know. I, I'm just I'm just quoting the law to you, ma'am, but. I just want to know what is this floor used for? Never been here before. Yeah. Court. So obviously a state court? This is New York State Court, yes, but this is in the city of Long Beach. Okay. Yeah, because this is the city hall building, correct? Correct. Okay, great. And this is a state court? New York State Court, yes, or New York State Court Court officers. officers. Great. Yes. Sounds good. And um, so I just have to pass this mag to walk around, correct? Correct. Okay, great. But I cannot allow you into this area filming. You are outside of it right now, but yeah. I can't allow you to film inside. You're so not, I, as you should know, the law, you are not allowed to film well, inside the courthouse. I know I can't film inside a courtroom. I'm not so sure if I don't if I don't have the right to film in the hallways. This is, these are public hallways open to the public, you know man. What? Well, let me get my supervisor sure. and you can discuss this with her. Can I get just your name and your badge number? Yes, my I'm Officer Friel and I'm and your badge number is 7089. This is yeah. my sergeant. Sergeant Kurt here. Hi, Sergeant. So what are you going to do? And your badge number is? I'm sorry. Here. You can... Do you guys have the same last name? No. Oh, I, I thought it was the same last name. Sorry, I got confused. Um, yeah, no, I was just asking your officer here uh, what was on this level. I wasn't exactly sure. And um, I'm, doing, I'm working on a story. I'm an independent okay. journalist. So I wanted to walk... I wanted to walk around in the, the publicly accessible areas in the courthouse. I'm not going to go into any courtrooms or anything, just to document what's going on up here on the uh, second floor here. All right, I'll ask the clerk and see what they have to say. Okay, that's, 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 that's fine. Just on a... Yeah. Mm -hmm. what, what kind of entity do you work for? What entity do I work for? Well, what, what, I guess... Oh, I'm independent. I'm oh, an independent okay. journalist, yeah. Okay. I work for myself, okay. and I work for the people, really. Mm -hmm. You know what, uh, officer? I'll be back. I'm gonna I'm gonna go check out the rest of City Hall, and hopefully by the time she'll have an answer for me. Okay. This is actually a pretty good view of the city of Long Beach. You see the ocean there in the background. looks like the city council chambers here
How you doing? What are you doing? Excuse me? I said, what are you doing? What am I doing? You refused to sign in downstairs, correct? No one asked me to sign in. Yeah, no. you need to sign in at the front desk. No one asked me to sign in, ma'am. The officer down there said that he did. Well, that's why I'm recording, ma'am. Can I know who you are first? Could you just come down with me and sign in? Can, can I know? You can come through the building. Ma'am, can I, can I know who you are first? Just come I don't, in with me I don't know. I'll tell you who I am. I don't know who you are, ma'am. I don't know who you are, sir. You need to sign in to but be you're, you're the one confronting me, ma'am. No, I'm with all due respect. You. I'm asking you to come downstairs and comply with the rules I walked, and sign in. I walked into a publicly accessible building, ma'am. I'm not going to go in and, and jump through your hoops. Just I, I walked in. No one told me to sign in. No one. This is a public building. Yes, and, and there's, there's, I have a, right there's to a be rule here. that you should sign in downstairs. There's a rule. I'm just asking you to come downstairs and sign in. No, ma'am, I'm not going to go downstairs and sign in. No, I'm not going to do that because that, that's me giving up my personal information. Well, she was very rude. City Comptroller. How you doing? Hey, how are you doing? All right. Uh, I think you failed to sign in downstairs with me. Yeah, you never told me to sign in, though. Perhaps the mess, I did, but perhaps the mess. But you got to sign in. I'm not sure if this is allowed, but uh, yeah. with, with me, you got to sign in, though. Yeah, you could, right. you could put on, you could put down a uh, No, no, I can't write anything name. for you. You have to sign in. No, I'm not going to give up my rights and sign away my, and sign yeah, a but name. You're in the building. Yeah. It's not to stop you from doing anything. Just with me, and you know, you got to sign in. Okay, it's not but you didn't, you didn't tell me that, though. Uh, perhaps. Okay, so let me, let me finish handling my business here really quick, and then I'll, I'll get down there. I gotta go with you so you could sign in. Then you I mean, you can follow. Up. You can follow me everywhere you want. Yeah. No, no, no. I'm, I'm not stopping you. I uh -huh. don't know if this is allowed or not. You yeah. understand? Uh -huh. What I'm saying is, you gotta sign in with me. Yeah. Then you do what you gotta do. But I'm already in the building. So what is it? I, I, I could, I could easily take care of that when I go back downstairs. I'm signing out. Yeah, I can easily take care of that when I go back downstairs. Then you're signing out. But if you're here, you gotta sign in. If you're in yeah. the building, that's the policy. It's downstairs too. I'm, and down this is, there. I'm trying to get the policies. I want to just come, confirm you're what you're saying. To somebody here? Yeah, I'm, I'm trying to talk to somebody here. And then I want to go to the city manager's office. See, that's when you got to sign in with yeah. me to do all the, any other steps. You got to sign in with me. Yeah, Anything that's from, from now. You got to sign in with me. But I want to, I want to contest what you got to do. But what I'm saying is, I want to, cont I, I want to contest that policy that you have to sign in. To sign in, correct? It's down there. Yeah, no, I want to contest it. I want to contest that policy. I want to see it in writing from the city manager's office. And I want to contest it because this is a public building. This is a city hall. So I shouldn't have to sign in in order to get to a city hall. Why, why would I need to? This is a public building. So that's why I want to take it up with the city manager. I know you're just, you know, security, right. but, you know, for the building and you're just doing your job. But at this point, I'm just trying to contest it and see what's going on here. Can I get um, your name? There's a sign downstairs. Yeah. I get everything you said. Uh -huh. There's a sign that says, that says to come in the building. You must Hold on, this guy's just coming up, so I'm gonna move. I'm okay. gonna move like this. You must sign in in the building. So anything from here on, you gotta sign in with me. If you wanna go anywhere else, you must sign in. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like I said, I don't know if it's allowed or not. I'm not stopping you, but with me, you gotta sign in. Yeah. Well, you never. I mean, when you came in, perhaps there was other people. I didn't get a chance to tell you, but right now I'm saying you gotta sign in. Yeah. All right. No. So but, you could only come with me and sign in, and then you do whatever you gotta do. No, but what I'm saying is I've already been in the building, so well, you, my, you got you you want to go up to the city to the city manager. Yeah, correct. Any any, any other step you gotta do, you gotta sign in. Yeah. That's what it is. Hold up. I'm just going to go on the other side of you. I don't want you you're guys... Gonna, uh, no, you're going to sign in. I don't want you guys uh, blocking me in here. Well, can I get Can I get your name and badge number, sure, officer? You're literally looking right at my name and my badge number. Well, I would like you to identify yourself. Okay. That's all. Would you go sign in, please? Hi. How are you? How are you? Good. Thank you. Good. Would you just go sign in, please, and then you conduct all your business? That's well, I, 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 pa I passed security, and I didn't have to sign in. He didn't He didn't tell me to sign in. He didn't tell me to sign in. As I'm already in the building? you need to sign in. Yeah, what what law what law is that, officer? You're an, you're That's you're you're a law you're a law enforcement officer. Yes, I am. Can I get your name and badge number, please? It's Inspector De Palm. I don't have a badge number. Okay, Inspector. Nice to meet you. Um, that's not a law to sign into a building. There there is no law. Can you? It's our policy. Otherwise, you're trespassing. But you're not pol you're not policy enforcement. This, you're this law is, enforcement. This is a this is a secure building. Okay. I understand that. So we're asking you to go sign it. Okay. So and I don't have to give. Can, I don't wait. I'm not going to give up any of my. Uh, my identification. I'm not giving you my license or anything like that. So it's still clear before you need I go, to go downstairs. Inside, downstairs and sign in. What are the, the what are the pro, what are the procedures for signing in? We'll, we'll discuss this downstairs. 
why can't I just know the procedures? I'm gonna go sign in, okay. but I'm not gonna anything. give you my uh, my license or anything, just so we're clear, okay? Okay, great. Whatever you decide. Great. Hi, can I get your name and badge number? Officer O'Connor, 230. How about you, officer? Officer Reinhardt, 289. Great. And you guys are Long uh, City Long of Long Beach Police? Yes, sir. And you are City of Long Beach uh, Police, law enforcement, sir? Indeed. Okay, great. Just wanted to make sure who everybody is. Uh, there's a policy that says, just real quick, there's a policy that says there can only be two people in an elevator at a time. So uh, you guys can catch the next one. I'll go with you. Can you get a Yeah, people? we don't want to break any policies here. No, That's no, I'll go, I'll go with you. Great, 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 great. Uh -huh. Long Beach doesn't have uh, body cameras yet? Not yet. Not yet. Maybe Hopefully they come day. in soon, right? Maybe one day. Are you from Long Beach? No, I'm not from Long Beach, no. Okay. Just visiting. All right. He's just gonna sign in. Just wanna see the, uh, can you show me the policy where it says to sign in? No, this is the sign in sheet. I wanna see the policy where it says to sign in. Hey officer, since you're such an expert in policy, can you can you show me the policy where it says I have to I sign in? I don't policy around with me. Did you identify yourself as a police officer to the third floor? I had a report of that. Is that true? I don't answer questions. Okay. I don't answer any questions. Fifth so Amendment, right? But at the end of the day, where's the care, policy? I don't carry the policy around with me. Did you sign in? But you're enforcing it, so why wouldn't you carry it around with you? Did you sign in, sir? I'm asking you a question, sir. That's a very interesting Before point, I, but did you sign in? I'm My asking you a question. And I'm not answering, just like you're not answering. So well, you're a public servant. Yes. I'm not. So I mean, you should just sign in like everybody else, and then you can conduct your business in City Hall. There you go. Okay. Put the time. What time is it? 4 there. There you go. Your destination. I'm going to go find that uh, policy. I have multiple destinations. Your you destination. want me to write them all? Yes, please. Write them all. So you guys are enforcing a policy that you don't even, you're not even showing me. Is that correct, officer? Inspector? Excuse me? You're, but you're, you're enforcing a policy that you can't even show me or articulate to me. Where is the policy? That's a, that's a sheet. The policy right there is him telling you you need to sign in to get an out of He can't create policies. He's a security guard. That's his policy. That's our policy. It's, it's your security guard's policy? That's the policy, yes. Policy can change, too. Yeah. That's the policy right now. If you need to conduct business, have, can you go conduct business and have a great day. I'll see you later. Yeah. So how would you even know that that's my name when I sign in? It seems like a silly policy. Yeah, it is silly. Okay. Thanks for admitting it. Appreciate it. Have a great day. So now that we signed in, Benjamin Franklin, for their stupid policy, let's get back to what we're here for. And they seem to have closed the door for the city comptroller. I guess they're following me around. No one's answering at the comptroller's office, so we're gonna go check with the city manager. Is that a work phone or a personal phone? It's a work phone. It's a work phone? Yes. Oh, that's great, so I'll be able to get it. You will, indeed. So they uh, they give you guys uh, expensive iPhones for yes, work? Yes, they do. Very, very cool. We'll do, we'll, your business, we'll look at, connecting mine. We'll look at the, uh, the budget. What rank do you have, officer? Please conduct your business. Sir, as a public servant, I'm just asking your rank, sir. Yes, you, you, you are. Yeah, what is your rank with the police yes, you department? Are. You can conduct your business now. 
feel free is to it, conduct your business anywhere you, you have But to. you want to you want to enforce policies, but it doesn't your policy state at the Long Beach Police Department to identify yourself to it members says of the that public? You can conduct your business when it's done in accordance with the city rules and regulations. That's what it says. And your does your so policy say to identify yourself, whoever you are? What, Thank what? you for that information. So would you like to comply with your policy at this time? Thank you for that information. Is there some business you need to conduct on this floor? Well, if you're not going to compl comply with your policy, I'll be put on a complaint against you for not... There you go. You're welcome to do that. So why wouldn't you? Is there you? some business you need to... Would you like to tell me, would you like to tell me his rank? Would you like to tell me his rank, Reinhardt? I'll use rank. What? He can tell you. He can tell you. Is there what? some business on this floor you need to conduct? Please yeah, I do. I do. Means. You're the one video, record you're video recording me, right? I'm trying to find the city manager's office, okay, that's all. I can help you with that. If you ask where the city manager's office well, was, I'd be more than happy to tell you it's right here where it's the city manager's great. office. Great, I appreciate that. I, now, now, can you just help me out one more thing and tell me your rank with the police department? My, my rank is written on my shield. It says lieutenant like you asked me five minutes ago. Oh, okay. I didn't, rem I didn't remember. Okay, I didn't well, remember. Okay, well, now you know. So thank you for that information. Lieutenant, now you great. There you lieutenant, go. great. If you'd like to see the city manager's office, here's the city manager's office. There you go. There you go. Fantastic. Thanks. There you go. Excuse me. You know, a little bit of respect and de-escalation will get you a long way, Lieutenant. Okay, just for future, just, just, you, just for, we'll just for future, just, just for future reference, a little bit of de-escalation and a little bit of respect will get you a long way. Okay, that's all. If you have business to conduct, City Hall closes in about twenty-four minutes. Oh. So you might want to conduct that rather quickly. Mm. Well, I, I, doesn't, does, it, does, it, does it seem like there's anybody who can help me, Lieutenant? How about you do, can you help me find somebody to, to con help me conduct my business? You haven't told me what business you need to conduct. I need to speak with somebody at the city manager's office, which you've kindly enough pointed out to me. And now that I'm in the city manager's office, there is no one here to speak to. And you, as you just stated, the building doesn't close for another 24 right. minutes. Who is it that you need to speak to? You're more than a representative from the city manager's office, sir. The, the same office that I'm in right now. That's all. If you that there's no one the here. Business, I can try and put you to the right person. I, I just want to speak to somebody. Go, there you go. You need to ring your bell. Oh. I didn't know anyone was here. Oh, great, 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 great. Hi, how are you? Can I get your name now? Uh, now that my I'm... name is John McNally. I'm the director of public relations. Director of public relations. Oh, that's great. You know, fantastic. Can I get your name? Oh uh, no, I'm not gonna give it. You okay. can check the sign-in sheet downstairs that okay. I that I signed in on. Okay. But um, so yeah, I just wanted to know there. I want to see the policy for requiring somebody to sign in to your to the city hall because just, the the officers couldn't supply me with that policy. Sure. If and you just foil it. Well, oh, you want me to do a Freedom of Information Act? Sure. Yeah, so, That's, just, so I would do that with the city clerk. So it's well, you, it's city. Or do you want me to hand it to you? I'd probably be able to do that on the spot with you. So Excuse me? Right. He's probably not going to be able to do that on the spot with you. A FOIA request? Correct. Why wouldn't he be able to do well, it on the spot? A FOIA request, it's five days for the city to acknowledge and then 20 days. No, 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 I understand that, but I'm talking about submitting, submitting the FOIA request. Right. You could do that. Or Today, you could correct? Sure. Yeah, okay. So I'm going to do that. Email, email address is foil at longbeachny.gov. Okay. And, 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 and my other question to you would be is that what, so is that policy been, I, I know you're not going to show me the policy, but that is in fact the case that it's the policy here of I'm this not building. Sure. You really, you're going to have to foil that to see what the policy is. Oh, okay. So you don't know any of the policies here as the media relations person. Okay. And is there somebody from the city manager's office I could speak to? Uh, there is her assistant and the city manager herself is in the meeting right now. Excuse me? The city manager is what? The city manager is in a meeting right now. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, I can understand that. So if, you know, if I can make um, an appointment to see him through his assistant, that'd it's be great. A, it's a she? Oh, to see to see her. Yeah. So if I can make so an appointment, would, how are you doing today? Do Good. I would email city manager, city manager. I don't like to waste my time. I'm already here, so I would just like to speak yeah, to her. Well, you're not going to be able to get into her today. She's booked out. No, I'm, again, I think we're we're misunderstanding each other, sir. I I, I want to talk to her secretary right now, so I can make an appointment with her secretary, who would have her, well, it would I, have her I, schedule would, in her would, in her what possession. I ask, what I would ask you to do is to email city manager is the best way to get on her calendar. Yeah. So email city manager. Or but I, I want to do it now. Is that a problem? I can't do it now. So let me do it for you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. And your availability? Anytime, whenever she's available. Well, her next available. Uh... Lieutenant, do you think that this is a good use of resources for the city of Long Beach to have officers so watching? She's going to check the schedule.
she will uh, get back to you. She's story. gonna give me a ring. Yep. Okay, great. And her secretary's name, and her name and her secretary's name were? Uh, city manager is Donna Gaden. Donna Gaden. Secretary is Gina. Gina. Okay, I'll be waiting on a phone call from Gina then. Right on, thank Mr. you. Franklin. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you. Also, day. one more thing for you. Sorry about that. It's uh, I'm trying to talk to the Comptroller's Office to get the annual budget mm -hmm. for this year. You can foil for this. Yeah, it's also should well, be it, it's, it should be available yeah, for, for ready use. That should not be for you. Okay, they told me it wasn't. So, oh. can you call down to them? Make sure that they. This is the budget. Yes, sir. Oh, great. Mm -hmm. No, I'm, I I understand that, ma'am. You, you can also use that budget online. It's on that website. No, correct. I'm just here already, so I want to take a look at it, and I'm not going to take it. I'm just going to look over it right now. It's fine. Are you Gina? Yes. Nice to meet you, Gina. Donna Gaden, city manager. As most know, the city of Long Beach was already experiencing significant financial stress. But when you have police officers wandering buildings, not doing anything, what do you expect? Well, the New I York mean, State when, when people are feeling uncomfortable yeah <laughs> i hear that a lot yeah i hear that a I, lot i can imagine i hear that a lot uncomfortable a lot of uncomfortable people in society i guess right well i feel uncomfortable that you're recording me you have cameras everywhere in this building and i feel uncomfortable about that well should uh, i call the police on you <laughs> if, if, if you feel uncomfortable i believe that that's uh, your right but you know they're I'm not sure. feelings police they're law enforcement that's all in my argument i, right. I get it we yeah. can have a debate about it but you know but there is you know government buildings i think it's understandable in these you know, days and times when somebody comes in with... Oh, in this day and age, you, you know, got all the cliches. Dark glasses, <laughs> you know, a high filming yeah. from, you know, both your glasses... And a body camera. From your body camera. Exactly. From, you know, Transparency, it, accountability, that's all. If you, you want to talk to me think, about it, uh, we can talk about it. No, I just, I think it's a reasonable thing for... I'm pretty sure you know you're making people feel uncomfortable, so... Oh, um, do I? Yeah, I mean, you do this quite a bit, so... Okay. You, you know the reaction that you get. Well, I mean, if you know about me, why would you feel uncomfortable? I, I'm standing right here and I don't. Oh. I'm just saying I think other people in this building, you know, okay. probably do, and that's why you have a few have I been? Here. But have I been unreasonable yeah. with you? No. Okay. That's all. That's my point, is that no matter what I'm, no matter what I'm holding or, you know, this is mm -hmm. not a, a weapon or, you know that, and I know that. No, but, you, you know, know, so it's just, I'm being reasonable. Place, I just want to look at budget. If work and started videotaping you on If I worked spot. in the public, I, I, you know what I would do? I would give them the best service I ever gave anybody to show that the city sure. of Long Beach... I wouldn't call the police. I would just say, hey, whatever you need. You want to see the budget? Here you go. You want to see our policies? No problem. Because that will shine a bit better light on the city of Long Beach than to have police officers just follow me everywhere like I'm some type of you know, I criminal. I, I tend to think that most of our residents that walk in and make a good faith effort without making a show of it probably receive that exact service that you're talking um, about. But. You just said I was being reasonable, so there is no show to speak of. But we except can the, agree to disagree. Except for the one you're going to post online. Well, it, if I'm not making a show and I post this online, mm -hmm. who would be making the show online? Your employees, correct? Okay. Org organizational chart. Let's see who's at the top. The residents of the city. Of course, because the residents of the city are the boss, right? Correct. You guys work at the behest of the residents and the taxpayers. I'm going to go get me some dinner today, pay some taxes, get me a nice hotel. You, know, you guys want this kind of engagement. Helps your uh, tax revenue. Wow, the average per capita income is $53,000. How do they even pay the taxes? Medium family income, 121, okay. Unemployment rate. You guys have a lot of great information in this book. Let me try. It's good. Well, nicely done. Hundred and four million in debt. Wow.
Media Relations. Your first name again was? John. John. Nice meeting you, John. Thank Mr. you so much. Mr. Franklin, my pleasure. You have a great day. You got it. I think we're good here, officer. You're good? I think, I think right. we're good, yeah. Awesome. Thanks. Mr. Reyes, you got all the information you needed? Sergeant, uh, Lieutenant, excuse me, Lieutenant Dodge. You got good, all see good, you good seeing you. Thank you for being, uh, thank you. just work on the people skills a little bit. That's all. Well, I'll be my only, you got everything you need. That'd be my only critique with you, but thank you. Have a wonderful evening. You too, thank you. Hi, guys. How are you? Can can I just get a can I just get a blank piece of paper and a pen so I can write a, a FOIA request a FOIA request? Give me a form. There's forms requested. Oh, there's forms. Thank yes. you. Not a problem. I'll be quick. I know you guys are trying to get out of here. <laughs> yeah, no, I'll, I'll rather take care of it while I'm here. Let's get out of the way. Thank you. Thank you, sir. I gave you two, just in case. Oh, thank you. Can I just get a pen? Yeah. Thank you. Oh, uh, well, I'm very neat. I'm very neat. All right, so we're requesting the signing policy for City Hall here in Long Beach, as well as the first, last name, salaries, and titles of all employees here at City Hall. All right, and my email, my email's on. I'm gonna send it to my email. Okay. Thank you, sir. Appreciate your time. Thank you. Take care, sir. Thank you. Where you at? That's you right here? Yeah, Benjamin Franklin. Okay, you can you put the time, man. No, no, no. You got to write. I can't write for you. Yeah. No, I'm not going to. I, I got to get out of here. Though. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. Right on the side of City Hall here is the police headquarters. City of Long Beach police headquarters. That's how they arrive so quickly at the City Hall. How you doing today? Good. So? Good. Hello, sir. Hey, how are you, Sergeant? Sorry about that. Did you take a look at the sign right here? I'm sorry. Oh, actually, it's posted out of the way. Off the time, there's been no video recording in the police precinct. Yeah, this is a this is a public lobby, Sergeant. Okay, I understand, but that's the policy of the police department. But policy doesn't trump law. I have a First Amendment right to record the police. Sir, not in the lobby. This is a uh, sensitive area. We have. This is not a sensitive area. There's, there's no. We have, we, have, we have matters of privacy that occur here. That's, okay, I'm that's simply not true. Leave. It's simply not true. Right, so Excuse I'm me, sir. Ask you to leave. Are you telling me that if I don't uh, first, can I get your name? Sergeant Alexander. Sergeant Alexander. Yes. Okay. So, are you telling me that if I continue to film in the lobby, you're going to be trespassing if you continue to film in the lobby? So you would arrest me for if I continue to film. How can I be of assistance to you? Great. You're gonna, I can't chase you no, I'm, I'm coming to you, Lieutenant. That's all. Uh, I'm making it easy for you. Keep a social distance, even though oh, sure, sure, sure. How can I be of assistance to you? Okay, so uh, Sergeant Alexander came out while I was filming in the police lobby. I was looking to speak. in the police lobby? Correct, yeah. Such a heinous crime, right? Well, yeah, you're not allowed to. Oh, but what, what law is that, Lieutenant? Trespassing. Wouldn't trespassing be being in a place I'm not supposed to be? Yes. And you telling me to leave and I don't yes. leave? And the signs that would be the statute, correct? Yeah. When you're videotaping in there and the signs are posted saying you can't guess that you can trespassing. But okay. So what that, a, what please, a my my my, my sure. Your complaint, so my complaint my complaint is is that I have a constitutional right to film the police and and law enforcement in the course of their duties. So how can I not be allowed to film based on your policy and be threatened to be arrested so you're telling me if i walk in there with my camera lieutenant that you're going to arrest me for you can film out here absolutely you can film this all day yeah but right I, I believe that it's on from my knowledge of the law i believe that that policy violates my constitutional rights to film the police and government employees in the course of their duty that's not a restricted area lieutenant that's not you know any place with sensitive information that is a public lobby that everybody should be allowed to go into and feel free and welcome to go into and record for transparency reasons. What's Unfortunately, that, transparency reasons? yeah, transparency and accountability. So that's correct. What accountability your your department, your department doesn't seem to have body cameras as most of the nation does. So, yeah, so I would prefer 
that if I'm conducting business or any citizen journalist conducting business here at Long Beach City Police Department, they should be able to film in the public lobby, sir. It's a public lobby. That's not a restricted area. You, no, you, Mr. Reyes, there is a policy that says you can't record in the lobby. You can record out here all day long and we'll be more than happy to sit and talk with you all day long. That's can you can you can you show me the policy, sir? I explained the policy to you. Oh, but can I can I see it or I or would have to do a FOIA request for it? Uh, a no, FOIA that, request. That, that is the signs are posted that you can't record in the lobby. Yeah, but you printed that out on a computer. To be fair, so, Lieutenant, you printed that out on a computer. And the policies are written on a computer as well. Yeah. But they usually have to be approved you're by higher authority. To, you are welcome to record out here. We can record this business all day long. Yeah. We certainly had a wonderful time recording throughout City Hall. City Hall was we great. With you. Great. And you're having a wonderful time. So what is it? You asked me to come here so that you could have a complaint. So I'd like my to take my complaint report. is that your policy here, Lieutenant, is unconstitutional. That's my complaint. So that, the complaint is about the policy being unconstitutional. Correct. And being threatened to be arrested by not only now Sergeant Alexander, but, but yourself for trespassing. Trespassing doesn't say anything about filming in public, okay. sir. You would be using that crime of trespassing. I have every right to be in that lobby. Can we agree on that? You can certainly go into the lobby. You can't record me. So if I record in the lobby, I'll be charged with trespass, criminal trespassing. And that that is that and that is my complaint, and that would be my complaint with the police department, sir. Okay, so you, you know, do you have a chief? The sergeant, the sergeant for now informing you of the policy. I'm I'm not sure what the complaint. I my my complaint is against the policy in its totality. Okay, so the complaint is not about the officer. The complaint is about the policy. The policy, correct. The policy. And he should know better to enforce a policy. He's law enforcement. He's not policy enforcement. He's law enforcement, just like yourself, sir. I told you this at City Hall. There's laws that you enforce. And that's it. That's your job. You took an oath to the Constitution of the United States to uphold the Constitution. Well, thank you for that you should you should take that oath very seriously. And that oath and that Constitution says that I'm allowed to film. I'm allowed to redress my government. Film the Supreme Court has said that I can film government employees in the course of their duties. Out of a, not the Supreme Court, it's, um, a district court, federal district court. It's case law, Turner v. Driver. I can film government employees in the course of their duties. If you're preventing me from doing that, that's a violation of my civil rights, sir. Thank you and for you're, that information. And you're, you're doing that. By that policy is, is exactly what it's doing. Thank you for that information. What do you have to hide in there? What is, what, can you tell me the reason behind the policy, Lieutenant? Well, I could. There are people that discuss private matters in there. They come in with their own personal matters to discuss with the desk officer, which is why the policy is in place. So, so to protect here, people's privacy in public? People's privacy as they come to the police department for assistance. But if they have something private to tell you, I, I would suggest that you take them to a... You don't have an interview room? How would you know the, what they had to discuss was private unless they allocated that to you first? But the courts have also ruled there's, the courts have also ruled there's no expectation of privacy in public. See, that's and that's a public lobby. That's a public... Facility. But it's a public it's lobby, sir. Facility. Okay, well, so I, I see we're not going to agree. You are welcome to videotape out here all day long. No problem whatsoever. Enjoy yourself doing it. So what are you going to do about my complaint about your policy? Well. Should I should I just speak to the city manager or should I speak well, to the, the chief? That, or we can take the information from you with regards to a complaint about policy. Let's take a... Yeah, I believe your policy to be unconstitutional. Let's go to the extent that we can. And okay. we will investigate this. Can I ask your last name? You, you guys have all my information. No, no, I, 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 don't. I don't. Yes, no. you, you called me by my last name, sir. I called you by your last name, but if I'm going to be able to take this complaint, I'm going to have to be able to fill out this Sir, I don't, I don't know who you are. Okay. So, if look, this, this is a civilian complaint form. That's correct. If you would, would like, like me to do out. it, yeah. I will, but I'm going to need the information. I'm just going to summarize for you, right? You have an issue with the policy as it violates your civil rights and the fact that you were told that you would be arrested if you filmed in the lobby. Correct. Okay, your email, I'm going to spell it out. Long Island Audit, L O N G I S L A N D A U D I T at gmail.com. That's correct. And you are Sean Paul Reyes. Correct. Okay. And I'm gonna, you, you were here about five o'clock, pretty much when I was coming into work. Around there, should okay. be fine, approximately, you yeah. know. All right. I have all the information I Thank need. you, Sergeant. Thank you, Lieutenant. You I will well. be following up with the city manager as well. Okay. Thanks. Very good. Thank you very much. Have a good one. All right, you are.
All right, guys, so we're just getting out of City Hall and the police department here in Long Beach, New York, right here on Long Island. Overall, I would definitely say, you know, a fail. Not a strong fail, but a fail nonetheless. To start off and recap, when I first went into the court, the New York State Court area, the court officer was, you know, very confrontational about my filming. Um, never, never got to go back there and film past the mag as the building was closing. But, you know, filming the city hall presented a problem where they called law enforcement on me. Uh, building security never told me to sign in and then wanted me to sign in after the fact, which I did under Benjamin Franklin. And, uh, you know, they w weren't going to get any ID from me. And it's just a stupid policy that even as you guys saw that the officer, the inspector there, he agreed with me. So, you know, I'm going to take that policy up with the city manager. I'm trying to schedule a meeting with her. As well as, you know, the policies for the police department here as far as filming in the public lobby when I went to go file my complaint I was threatened with being arrested for trespassing by Sergeant Alexander and the lieutenant saying that it was a lawful policy you know I tried to explain to them that policy does not trump law that they took an oath to the Constitution you know looked like it went in one ear out the other they did take in a formal complaint from me which I'll be following up with the commissioner here, Commissioner Walsh and the city manager about regarding both policies in the police department as well as the city hall. And we're gonna hold them accountable. Make sure you hit that like button, subscribe, turn on notifications for the follow-up video coming on this to see what happens. Let me, guys, let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. I'll be there early. As always, stay safe. God bless. I'll see you in the next video. Long Island Audit. Peace.